Okay, here we go. It's Garrett. We got a four versus four. We're going to go mastermind. Let's go redraw. And let's see. Welcome to Nova. Let's get, okay, we're going to keep the butcher. Keep the harpy for sure. Okay, we have to keep one more. Um, let's keep the millennium. Okay, there we go. Let's spin again. Let's get rid of the ranger and grab the mask. Let's grab the tempest. Let's try one more time real fast. Okay, do we want the ranger? Wow, we don't have a tank. I just realized we don't have a tank. We don't have a tank here. <laughs> yes, sir. There we go. We found the tank. We have a real tank. <clears throat> um, a partial tank. Healer DPS, DPS, Mega DPS. We need to roll with the harpies here and the butcher. This could be a little tricky. We have one and a half tanks, if you see that. Then we have an aura here. DPS, DPS, DPS. Eighty-one, fifty, thirty, thirty. I'm I'm not gonna build a worker right now. You know what we're going to do? We're going to put down two harpies instead. Okay. <clears throat> Let's see what happens. Let's take a look at my teammates before I tell you the true story. Um, okay. And let's go ahead and move this out of the way. We'll put it down there so we can scroll out and look at a couple fights at the same time. Okay, we need to build a worker now. Do you know I've been trying to walk with the Lord Jesus for a while now? For, it's, it's starting to become a long time. You know what? Let's go ahead and order another worker. And what I learned is, okay, everybody cleared. Here's our defense. What I learned is that throughout the years, there will be many times where the Lord himself will take away my Bible reading and he'll even take away my worshiping of him. And at first, this was a little nerve-wracking. We might get breached here. Let's see how the harpies do. We might get breached. At first, this was a little nerve-wracking, a little disconcerting. Yeah, we're gonna get breached, it looks like. I needed to I needed another harpy. Okay. Hopefully my teammates will cover for me. And we have a small defense. So when the Lord takes away your Bible reading and takes away your worshiping, that could make a person nervous. And I used to be really worried about it and, um, you know, battling addictions and fear, anxiety, and everything else. You know, sometimes I would be really concerned about this. Okay, let me take a look here. How, how do we want to fix this? We can do two harpies and a mask or a tempest. The tempest is 33 DPS, 22. We're going to go harpies. 
Yeah, we're gonna go harpies. So years would pass by and I would read the Bible for a while and then basically the Lord would take it away and I would worship him for a while and it's so much fun and it's exciting and the joy and his presence coming into your into your heart and soul. I mean, it's so much fun. But then he would take it away. We have the boss here. I'm not going to build a worker. I'm building a little bit less workers nowadays and I'm building more troops. Let's go look at the enemies. The enemies are clearing. So years would go by and this would happen over and over again. I would get a season of reading the Bible and worshiping. And then I would go through a season where it's taken away from me. Okay, we have 142. We can't build a butcher. It would be so nice to get a butcher out there. I'm going to get breached here. Four harpies or one tempest? Let's do harpies. Not enough gold. Um, I fully expect to get breached here, especially since he added two attackers. Um, the harpies are going to have to dominate for a chance here. Let's look at it. let's look at all three of us. And then we have a fourth teammate over here. Yeah, the harpies are carrying. Maybe some of you have noticed that the Lord takes your Bible reading away sometimes. Maybe you might have noticed that he takes the gift of worshiping away sometimes. I'm looking around. Okay, we have 117. We can go. We can go one tempest or we can go three harpies. Well, hello. There we go. You might have noticed that the Lord takes the Bible reading away, doesn't he, sometimes? And you might have noticed he takes even worshiping of himself away. Wasn't that shocking when that first happened to you? Let's see, we're on wave number six. Let's build a worker. Let me ask you a question. Isn't it extremely humbling when God takes your Bible reading away? And likewise, isn't it extremely humbling when God even takes the ability to worship away? We can do two harpies and a mask, or we can do one tempest. Let's do a Tempest. Okay. I'll tell you something. It is very... Let's watch somebody else. <clears throat> it is very, very humbling when the Lord God Almighty snaps his finger and takes the ability to worship him away. Are we okay here? Kind of, not really. I th yeah, we're clearing. Okay, we cleared, everybody cleared. And how about the enemies? Looks like, yeah, looks like they're fine. Okay, it's time to build a sand badger. 
which is a real tank. You know what? Let's do a butcher. Now, let's get him out. Put him right here. A little bit in front. Just a little bit in front. <coughs> We've got 40 Mythium. Let's upgrade the king. So what I want to share with you is the Lord God is crushing our pride by taking the Bible reading away from us from time to time. It's very humbling. And when he stops you from worshiping, <laughs> that is humbling. See the difference of having two tanks? We're doing really good here. Okay. We'll look at my teammates. So some of you might be thinking, well, Garrett, it's not God that's stopping me from reading the Bible. And it's not God that's stopping me from worshiping him. It's actually Satan. Garrett, you're wrong. <clears throat> Let me share something with you. If Satan has the power to stop our Bible reading, and if Satan has the power to stop us from worshiping God, he is now God. You've actually made him God now. That's what you've done. Three harpies or one tempest and a mask. Let's go. Let's go three harpies, I guess. Let's upgrade the king. Here's our king back here. You can see he's almost fully upgraded. <clears throat> if you believe Satan has the power to stop you from reading the Bible, to stop you from praying, to stop you from worshiping our Messiah, God's Son, you're now making him out to be God. And we don't want to do that. He has a cannoneer in the back here. Looks like... Oh, this is going to be a very tough fight. That cannoneer is really hurting me. Um, let's see what happens. Yeah, we got breached. That cannoneer costs 100 Mythium. She's right here. That's wave 9. Now we've got the wave 10 boss. We have 10 workers. So we never, never want to make Satan out to be God. We never want to give Satan credit, glory, nor honor. That's the last thing we want to do. We need a butcher for healing. We have 123. Let's get a Tempest. And we have enough for one mask. I guess right about there. We never want to give Satan credit, glory, nor honor. Try your best to stop doing that. Just the best you can. <clears throat> So why would God take away our Bible reading? To crush our pride. To humble us. To show us how badly we need his spirit. We need to order right now. To show us how badly we need his Holy Spirit living inside of us. Um, he cleared... He got breached. Let's look at the enemies. Um, we breached them right here. That's a mimic. Those are actually really powerful. <laughs> it's a fun game. They got funny looking stuff, funny names, but it's a cool game. Sometimes the Lord takes away our Bible reading. 
Give me one second. Let me check. Are we okay? Yeah. Give me one second. Um, no. Yes, no. Let's take the income. We have 286. What can we do? Can we do the butcher? Yes. Or a sky queen. I think the butcher. 21 gold. There's nothing we can do. Let's see if we can get the mythium up to 80 for a dino before the timer goes off here. Sometimes the Lord takes away our Bible reading and our worshiping to show us, to show you that Bible reading and worshiping the Lord God, it is a privilege, not a right. It is a gift from God, not a right. And sometimes he takes it away to show us that. And it can hurt. It can hurt when you lose your Bible reading. It can hurt when you lose your worshiping. Um, it used to hurt me. I used to feel really worried and disconcerted and I didn't know what was going on. Let's see, we got breached. Let's check our defense. So sometimes he takes it away to show you that reading the Bible and worshiping Him is a gift. It is a privilege. It's not a right. It's not a right. Everything is a gift from God. We can't upgrade yet. So, tough decision. Um... The game says we're too weak, and I agree. I think we are too weak. I really do. <laughs> there we go. <clears throat> Let's get a fiend out right before the... Okay, there we go. You see, children of God, many of you think that you're entitled. That you're entitled to read the Bible. You're entitled to worship the Lord. You're entitled to get to know Jesus. And entitlement is based off of pride and ego and, and self-centeredness and, and fleshly thoughts and fleshly desires. Entitlement is evil. I need the Sky Queen to carry here. We're in big trouble. She's got to carry really badly. Um, let's see what happens. We barely cleared. Okay. <clears throat> We're on wave number 12. Children of God, everything that we gift from God is a gift, it's a present. Everything we get. We have 168. We can put down a butcher or we can build a sky queen. Let's check. 1330 healing. Let's go with the butcher. Let's put the butcher right here. Let's build a cannoneer. Let's go. So that's one of the reasons. That there's, there's a few of the reasons why the Lord God Almighty takes away your Bible reading and your worshiping. To crush your pride, to crush your ego, to show you that you're not special, only Jesus is special. To show you that you're not important. Only God's grace is important. Only God's grace. And he's showing us that we need his spirit. We need his Holy Spirit inside of us. <clears throat> Do you see what I mean, children of God? And sometimes he's taking them away to break your pride of feeling entitled. We Christians have a terrible 
terrible habit of feeling like we're entitled to all of these benefits and nothing could be farther from the truth. Let's get some Sky Queens. Let's see, 88. We can do two more Harpies. Let's see if we can make it to 80 Mythium to build a, a Dino, Dino or Dino, whatever. We're not entitled to anything. Everything is a free gift from God, and you do not deserve it, and neither do I. <clears throat> we don't deserve anything except the lake of fire. But in God's love, in God's mercy, in God's tenderness, yes. he chose us. If you're a chosen one, he chose you. He chose you. And now he gives you the gift of praying sometimes. Not all the time. Sometimes. And he gives you the gift of Bible reading sometimes. And he gives you the gift, the honor, and the privilege of worshiping his son Jesus sometimes it is a gift it is not a entitlement give me one second um, we have 590 do I want to upgrade that for 335 yeah I think we will I'm going to put a Butcher right next to him because they're going to be healing each other. And let's go with two more harpies. <laughs> and let's send a cannoneer or a drake if we can make it. Got it. We got the drake. So let's watch a couple fights here. This is the boss. Wave 15 boss. That's the message that the Lord has for you today. There's a few of the reasons why he's taken away your Bible reading from time to time. Why he takes away your worshiping from time to time. <laughs> and I want you to know with me, it's always worked out for my good. And for you, if you're a chosen one, it's going to work out for your good. Romans 8.28 promises it's going to work out for your good. And if you're a chosen one, I am promising you it's going to work out for your good. So there's a few of the reasons how and why we lose our Bible reading, our worshiping of God, Who's doing it? It's not Satan. It's God the Father through his son, Jesus. Let's upgrade the butchers right now and stop fooling around here. How many workers do we have? 25? Not too good. Not too good. Not too bad. Let's get another mask down. I lose Bible reading all the time, sometimes for a week, sometimes for a month, sometimes for far, far, far longer than that. And I've lost the ability to worship the Lord God for long periods of times before. And I want you to know, it's working out for my good. It's going to work out for your good too. Trust the Lord. This is really tough. Really, really tough. He has two drakes here. One drake back here. Three drakes here. So he got breached really badly. And for me, um, this is my new style of playing. Um, 
A few less workers and, and more military units. That's what I'm doing now. Shut down. It's, if you're a chosen one, it's going to work out for your good. Trust the Lord. He knows when you should read the Bible. He knows. He knows when you should. Okay. Let's see. Men of God, women of God, what should we do? We've got two tanks, three butchers. Tough decision. Let's go Sky Queens. Can we do one more? And one more Harpy. We have 13 seconds. The Mimic is fine. I love the Mimics. We'll put down a Witch. <coughs> and she is right there. So let's watch all three fights. That's the message for this video. I pray you're being blessed and you'll relax about it. Calm down. The Lord knows when you should read the Bible and when you shouldn't. He knows when you should read the Bible. Trust him. He's perfect. He never makes mistakes. He cleared. We cleared. This teammate got breached. Let's check the enemies. Yeah, the enemies are rocking and rolling. We built another Mimic right here. Here, you can read that if you want to. That's what the Mimic does. And can we get any gold? Lock and load. Let's see, our teammate got breached. So as far as the message, that's it. Let's see if we could win this. Not because of pride, I couldn't care less. Let's win because everything we do, we're doing unto the Lord. Let's, let's get a tank. Let's put the tank right here. Right there. Tier two. Sky Queen. Mimics are fine. The Mimic is this little box. If you see that, that's the Mimic. These are our attackers for the next turn. And let's build another. There, we built a few more too. Wave 18 is really hard. Let's see if we can clear. I did add a second tank. He's right here. Without this tank, uh, we would be in big trouble, but he's still... Okay, he's dead. And now I need the Sky Queens to carry. I don't know if they will. Let's see. Pumping out workers. We're at 59 workers. We got breached. And... Okay, they... Oh, you know what? This might be game over. We could be dead. We're probably dead. I'll keep building just in case. Yes. But yeah, it looks like we're dead. Praise God. I hope you enjoyed the message. Don't worry. Trust the Lord's plan. Um, let's look at the stats. Here I am. Uh, I go right to worker 61. Look, they, they had a... They had a player with 90 and 71 workers. Look at their Mythium. I'm sorry, right here. Look at their Mythium. Look at their income. So those two, those two players played fantastic. These two right here. All right, praise God. Bye for now.